So we're looking at O2 heater circuits, okay? Bank two, we got the second after cat and before cat. Basically, right now we're on after cat. You can see it's pulse width modulating on uh, pin 19. If we go to pin uh, 18, which is the first sensor, we got 14 solid volts, no ground, no actuation. So this guy right here, this ground wire, dead. This guy right in here, internally, fried. And if we go over here, look at statuses. We got both heaters before cat, commanded on for the heater. And after commanded on, so you can see that the one is pulsing and the other one is not. That's why we have the heater fault. That's why we got nothing and we have something. Now, where's that scope? Anybody got that scope real quick? Yep. All right, now that we got the scope hooked up, now we can see this pulse with signal on the heater circuit occurring. So, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's just look, got five volts here. Okay, so, that's too fast, way too fast, that's why. Let's go 10 milliseconds, there we go. Okay, so if we look at our scope, what's happening here? See it's changing? Let's go to slow it down a little bit more. So that's our heater circuit, right? Pulse with what? Cam, you seeing it? This is the, uh, this is the one that's working. This, this is, is the one that's working. This is pin 19 right here on the post cap. Okay. Now if you go to pin 18, go ahead to 18. Boom. Just solid voltage. Nothing happening. Even though uh, if you look at the statuses, so uh, check statuses, both state that they're on. So there you go. That's your problem right there.